Prime Minister Tong Sing Tamavong approved a governmental decree early this month to establish the support in a move to mobilize funds from various sources to finance activities in to fight against drug abuse and smuggling. The government is stepping up efforts to combat drug use and drug smuggling with the establishment of a fund to finance activities to fight drugs and related threats. According to the decree, the fund would be used to finance nine main drug fighting activities such as disseminating drug related laws, regulations and international treaties, and agreements to which laws is a state party. The fund will be used to carry out activities to educate and raise awareness among members of the public on the dangers of drugs, rehabilitation and treatment for those addicted to drugs, along with organization skills training for addicts will also be covered by the fund. The fund is said to encourage local people to cultivate alternative crops instead of crops with narcotic substances such as opium. Drug-related research and studies of other drug-fighting activities will also be covered by the fund in accordance with the decree. Chairman of the Lao National Commission for Drug Control and Supervision, Gu Jansima, welcomed the establishment of the fund. He said, Lao authorities were struggling to supply sufficient finance to fund anti-drug activities. Previously, finances to fund anti-drug activities mainly came from the state budget assistance from international donors and non-government organizations, as well as contribution from members of the society. According to the decree, the drug fighting fund would be raised from various sources, including the three main existing sources mentioned. In addition, between 60 to 70 percent of the fines from drug-related cases and the sales of evidence seized from drug-related cases will be contributed to the fund. Money raised from other activities in accordance with the decree will also be incorporated into the fund. Information regarding the amount of budget spent every year to fight drugs and its related activities were still not available. The fund which is expected to mobilize significant finance is seen as a crucial step in stimulating the government's effort in combating drug-related issues. This year, Laos Fund 1,147 hectares of illicit opium growing in some areas of the northern and central provinces during a satellite and helicopter survey combined with information collected by local authorities. In June, Lao authorities burned a massive quantity of drugs with an estimated street value of 17.5 million US dollars, about 135 billion K. The burning of the drug marked the 27th anniversary of the International Day Against Drug Abuse and Illicit Trafficking.